you, you guys, we've had to dig down for for literally every game in league this year. Um, it's a it's a it's a it's a really really good league. Um, they are, you know, there's a lot of talent in the league, and you know, guys are are uh, are giving us their best shot for sure. And uh, and I was really really pleased and proud of our group with the poise and the resilience they showed down the stretch. Um, because if if you've if you've been to a few of our Fort Wayne Omaha games in the past, it played out literally to a T of how they they typically do. Um, it's a game of runs. Um, they they can turn they can put points up on the board very very quickly. Both of us like to play fast, so there's a lot of of points on the board, um, and it usually comes down to the wire. And we've played, I bet, in my tenure uh, as an assistant and a head coach, we've played more overtime games with Omaha than anybody else in our league. Um, it just, it's always a nail biter. And uh, our guys over the, over years have done a really good job of ending up on, on the good side of a lot of these close games. And, uh, you know, I mean, what 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 great play from, from a, a bunch of guys because I mean we were in foul trouble all night I mean we're sitting in the first half with four guys four starters that had two fouls and playing different lineups and then we have you know our two primary point guards pick up their third early and then both of them pick up their fourth earlier than you'd like to play them with four um, and so we're, we're, we're battling through that and then you get to overtime and that's tough but uh, to, you know they made their run and they had good control of it. They punched us in the mouth late in the second half. And, uh, and our guys responded and came back and then took control of the game again. Uh, I think we we're up by as many as five. Um, they made another run. I mean, it's a game of runs. And for our guys to go into, into, uh, into overtime, where it's, it's always a little deflating when you have that lead and you lose it right before overtime and you had a shot to win it, um, you know, I, I was really pleased that our guys just stepped up, particularly the fact that they held them one for nine from the floor. That was good. And we've been uh, kind of having an up and down season. It was kind of about time that we kind of got a gritty win, you know, kind of a, a ugly win to go our way. I know we had only two turnovers in the first half, but we knew they were going to make their runs, and we just had to come back with our own runs, and we were able to do just that. There was something, go ahead. I was say something about, you know, Five players or four fouls, it kind of changes the flow of the game, you know. So, I mean, we dug deep, we stuck together, and we made it happen. Yeah, I think it just shows how, you know, how far we've come as a, as a unit. Our chemistry has you know, been building and building, and we're kind of just trying to stay even keel and not get too high and not get too low. And just, you know, it shows how we have each other's back.